Everybody, it's been a while since our last informative video. We've been traveling now for about two days since we left the Waco, Fort Worth, Dallas area. We're all the way down South Texas on the Mexican border. That's Mexico behind me. We're at Big Bend National Park. Uh, a couple of things to talk about in this video. A lot of followers have been asking us about how the travel trail has been going and how that's been working out. We're gonna talk about that and give you a quick tour of the inside and the outside. Also, followers have been asking us about how we're managing to be in such close quarters 24-7. Uh, we're going to talk about that as well in this video. First, I want to touch on some experiences we had down in, in the South um, and the impact that it's had on us. First and foremost is, is Southern hospitality is a real thing. We met a lot of people and they've been so kind, gone out of their way to be to be helpful and informative. That's just been a great experience. In addition to that, some of the places that we visited um, have really had a big impact on us. As for the places we've experienced so far, they've had a profound effect on our understanding of uh, American history. A lot of the stuff that we learned is either um, stuff that we've, we were not aware of or um, we had had in inaccurate information as we were raised, places like Poverty Point, Evergreen Plantation, the, the missions in San Antonio, the Alamo, um, very, very significant. It really had a tremendous impact. Uh, as for the travel trailer, uh, Terry came up with the idea in uh, January to purchase the travel trailer. Our original plan was, as you know, to hotel hop. Terry's idea of the travel trailer was a home run. It's a perfect platform for what we're doing. It contains all of our stuff, easy to move, uh, we're on the move three to, every three to four days. It's, it's the, perfect, um, the perfect way to travel. Um, it's our home base. It's it allows absolutely comfortable and clean um, living environment for us. We don't spend much time in it because we're always out touring and hiking and biking and so on. And it's a perfect place to come and crash, get a hot shower, hot meal. Um, it's really been a home run. So the travel trail has worked out really well for us. And again, we'll give you a quick tour of the inside and out of that at the end of this video. So uh, as far as us being together 24-7, uh, it has not been a problem. Um, again, most of, it, most of our time is spent touring and um, sightseeing and crushing your stop. head. And I'm crushing doing your all head. kinds of cool stuff. It's like a perpetual vacation. Will you stop? And... Um, so that's not been a problem at all for us. Um, we get along the, really good as long as I could <laughs> crush your head. So, the tra travel trail has just kind of been a home base, a good place to get a, uh, a hot meal, change of clothes, hot shower, and then in the next morning we're off again doing something. So um, that's worked out rather well. Terry? <laughs> it's Can funny. It's not funny. Stop. <laughs> Come on. In the middle of fucking nowhere here. Let's go. Stop. <laughs> Crushing your head. Oh, as for the travel trailer, here it is. Inside and out. And the end of this video, we'll just give you a couple of photos and some quick videos of what's going on in Texas. Uh, hopefully, the end of the month, we'll put a video together of our entire experience in Texas. Um, I got to tell you, this Big Bend area. I'm crushing your head. Stop it. Crushing, this Big Bend. Terry. Crushing your head. Stop. This whole Big Bend area of Texas. Um, this national park, uh, certainly not the world's most popular, 
when it comes to national parks, but I got to tell you, the world's most magnificent. And a lot of people have been saying it's some of the, it, it's one of the best national parks they've been to. Um, speak to you guys soon. It is unbelievably quiet. The silence is just, as they say, deafening. It's amazing. I've never heard such quiet. Sip <laughs> <Except> your fart. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. So guys, we're set up at the Big Bend Ranch State Park uh, on the Mexico border. So that's Mexico uh, right behind me. Um, quite remote here, no cell service. We only had, only means of communication is via satellite. Um, so the camper, you see we have uh, our, an outside setup here. Um, entrance door, both screen door and a solid regular door. We have an uh, electric canopy. You can see the vents there for a hot water heater. We have a mount for a TV, which we can bring from the inside out. Outdoor speakers, outdoor LED lighting. We have gas grill, which connects the gas tanks on the camper, some storage. Um, and there's some mountains in the background. That there would be Mexico you're looking at. Uh, big bay window in the front at the foot of the bed. That is uh, tanks for uh, propane storage. We also have uh, means for extra water when we're off the grid like this. Uh, and you see the slide out, which increases the uh, area inside uh, the camper. So when we're set up, that slide out um, is motorized and comes out of uh, the side of the uh, uh, the travel trailer. So in the back there, you see we have um, outdoor shower outlet. Um, power input uh, that would be wastewater drain and we have a uh, hot water heater uh, and additional storage and water inlets for city water. So now we'll let Terry take you through the inside. Hello everybody welcome to the inside of our trailer this is kind of my uh, terrain here um, just want to show you real quick we have this awesome refrigerator fully stocked uh, everything we need I have full storage in here for my uh, pantry I have my kitchen area here uh, where I can wash my dishes, um, hot and cold running water, um, drain pan, fully operational and I use it all the time, um, cooktop and oven. Uh, this is my uh, fan, works great. Inside I have all the things that we need for um, uh, incidentals. My microwave, okay, which is awesome. It's use our TV which pivots so we can watch it when we're in bed or when we're sitting on the couch. Um, we have our uh, stereo system. We have storage in here for where I have clothes hanging um, on, on my side, Richie's side, he has the same thing. Um, overhead we have more storage, uh, very comfortable bed, and we have underneath storage as well. So has a safe down here so that when we're not in the unit, um, all of our uh, equipment is safe in there. This is our couch area and when we want to eat we have this nice table that we set up. There's more storage in here. We have reading lights, uh, nice big window where we have a beautiful view from. Also beautiful view out there. I don't know if you could see it. Over here we have our climate control, um, heat and air conditioning. Air conditioning up here. Uh, we have our control panel over here, which shows us when our tanks are full. Um, and this is how we operate uh, the, the heat, gas, uh, water, electric, uh, interior lights. Um, our awning in and out and our slide in and out. Here's our full bath. 